All right, bass fishing. Wilman's with me. Wilman hasn't been on the channel for 46 years. And uh, we're actually bass fishing, and I'm using g -g 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 Guggen. Yes, Guggen bait. I'm gonna go with a worm in a color that uh, <laughs> that has worked for me in the past here. So I'm gonna start with this. If I don't get any bites, probably switch to a crank bait. But there's a lot of activity, so I think things will be good. Well, man, are you already tangled? I'm just gonna cut the line. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, cut the line, and then you should be able to like, at, from the real side, pull it out from the spool. Yeah. If you require assistance, let me know. Okay. <clears throat> Ooh, well, I'm gonna cast right over here. All right, a lot of jumping over here, so. And I'm gonna just kind of bounce it off the bottom. <clears throat> Whoa. That did not go how I planned, but fell. Why are you so far back? Are you scared of the water? No. I don't think you're gonna scare any of the bass. They're pretty used to people being around anyways. Actually, I just remembered a bait that I have that I've never used, that I've always wanted to, and this lake isn't as snaggy, so this would be a good lake to try it. <clears throat> That'd be a first and kind of something a little different. Yeah, you should try where I was, where all that activity is, since yours is meant to mimic bait fish more so than mine. Try this worm just a little bit longer. Then I'll go ahead and switch. There we go. All right, throwing for first time ever. Umbrella rig. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. Oh, that's heavy. Yeah, it looks cool. I don't know if the best like it looks cool, but I'll do. Oh God, I got really lucky. That was almost the end of the fishing trip. All right, this bait's a little too obnoxious. It was worth trying though. Uh, next, I'm going to uh, put on our old friend the lipless, see how that goes. All right, third lure switch. We are with old reliable here. I got red, he's, got, he's putting on a chrome shad. We'll see which one does better. And I wish I would have taken my car because I had a, another chrome one actually in my in my uh, car. But took the girlfriend's car, so. Go over here. There's a lot of activity, you'd think. Carp! You'd think that there would be something around. Woman, well, you're a tangled machine. Whoa, hey, hey, huh, don't mind if I do, I'm gonna start right now. Another time. Yeah. Whoa, ha, ha, he, ha, ooh, ha. There was no water, I'm okay. And 
if the cranks don't work, I'll try uh, going back soft plastics, I guess. I don't know what else to do. With all the activity, I had such high hopes. You know? Are you making tea? Oh. That's just rude, man. Yeah, it looks like it's set in there pretty good. And this is going to be a, a baby bass colored fluke. Jesus. You gotta hook yourself, boy. <laughs> That's the plan. Why, Wilman? Why? I like teasing you. Yeah. I've noticed it's upsetting. Alright, gonna throw just a little bit down this way. And start freaking heading back. Captain's log, star date 45219830. Still no fish. No, sign of life. I'm gonna shit my pants at this rate. If I actually even so much as get a bite. I don't even have to catch it. Just give me a bite. Problem is I'll probably get snagged on the ledge here. I got one. Oh my god. He hit it on the fall. He came off. No! That was a that was a big one. Yeah, I can tell by the fence. Oh my god. Maybe this is a good spot. I I knew that cast was good. Mother, that was either like a catfish that grabbed it or which can happen or that was like at least a five pounder. Like, holy fuck. Got one. I got you this time, you son of a. It is a catfish. Yeah. Easy. That must be what it was. This is not a catfish pole, as you can tell, so. Uh, yeah. Like. Jesus. Still got some energy, but I need a I need my grippers. Do I have them? I hope I do. Oh my god. You are not done, are you? Come here, bud. I get tossed my lure. No, well. Yeah, I think the lure got wrecked. So God. It's not that big of a catfish, but I'm gonna get something for you. It might be a blue. Could you hold this and every time it charges, just kind of go with it? Like, kind of give a little, but not a lot. Zero. Four pounds, one ounce. 
Not bad. There he is. Nice blue. All right, bud. You're gonna have to make sure you let go. Don't clamp down. Don't do it. You're good. There he is. There it goes. Bye, bud. Well, that was a good time. Thanks for the help, Wilman. Couldn't have done it without you. Hey, Wilman, what did I literally just say? You were just talking about how you're not going to catch a bass. I By the way, you changed your jiggling of the motion of the bait. I said it wouldn't be stupid if I did, and then I did. God damn it. This is all we needed to do, is change the retrieve. And we would have been good. God, he wasn't coming off, though. Jesus. And I'm not... I'm not to... Uh, you know, risk getting fucking hooked by some people that do this popping thing. They're like... Ooh. That's a nice one. Yeah. Probably pretty close to two pounds. Alright. Um, yeah, I don't really need a picture. Thanks for filming, with the Wilman. You're Can welcome. Get a, get a release? Yes, sir. Thanks for playing, bud. There you go. Toodles. Told you. That's probably what we saw splash. Yeah. Well, this is just one of those. Hey, thank you. That's just one of those things where you figure out, uh, you know, that you're an idiot and all you had to do instead of changing lures was change how you presented the lure. Mm-hmm. Idiot! Idiot! God!